Hello, welcome to Kevic. My name's Alan Salt and it's my privilege to be principal here. Kevic is a proudly comprehensive school. We're kind, we're inclusive and we're committed to the absolute best for each and every one of our students. Kevic's a really great place to learn and it's a great place to work. And I'm lucky to be surrounded by colleagues who are absolutely passionate about what they do and wanting to get the best for all our students. Now we've made a short film so you can see for yourself what life is like here on a day-to-day -day basis. So in a moment I'd like you to sit back, relax, watch the film and enjoy it. And then what we'd like you to do is get in touch with us, um, contact us so that we can talk to you more. Um, we never tire about talking to people about what a special place this school is and we'd love to hear from you and continue that conversation. So enjoy the film and I hope to hear from you very, very soon. advancement to primary school it's in a whole new it's like it's taking a huge it's not just taking a step it's taking a leap um, the teachers yeah like like you said the teachers explain everything that you need to know um, the English at Kevix is um, really good the teachers explain exactly what you've got to do and you just get on with it and if you need any help then they'll just tell you exactly how they can help you no, it's not like primary school when you would probably like you would just stay away from everyone trying to get on your left. With here you can work with people and you can actually get into the working and it's just a lot of fun to work with people that also care about their work as well. we're doing more different subjects whether in primary school it would be like more or less but just like more so just doing one thing yeah. so like sketching and maybe we'll be cutting out some cardboard but this we can instead of just doing drawing we can make sculptures do photography and it's a bit more expanded art compared to like in primary school you um you would only do like art once like two months and like with Kevix art we can do it every week and it's more fun and it's something to look forward to. Yeah. Kevic is way more encouraging and like it gives it gives you more confidence than going primary school. I mean like it's more fun, you get loads of like little mini games and sometimes you get like rewards sometimes. Um, I like it how they will encourage you if you find one thing easy they'll give you a more challenging thing or if you find something too hard they'll give you a slightly easier thing and then work your way and they'll help you work your way up to get to the harder stuff. It's not like scary or anything. It's just, it's just, it's literally, it's just like a nice place to be. Like it's a nice environment. I really enjoy computing because everyone gets to have a go on a computer where you might not get to have a go on a computer at home. Uh, I enjoy computing because like everyone like learns new things about computing and like devices and stuff. So we use like different. Um, apps on the computers and we're shown how to do it first and then we try it out ourselves and we can ask each other for help and if we don't understand and stuff. So we have uh, drama, music and dance uh, and within that we do all of the GCSE courses. I hear music, it's BTEC. Um, and we also do the shows that we're all in. 
there is a piano in all the practice rooms that you could go and play piano and then you've got the drums and guitars depending on what you can play. Yeah, we're like a big family yeah. in the performing arts. We're all, we're all just a big family and we see each other when we're doing rehearsals and we have we come in on Sundays and it's fun. chemistry when you like actually get to like do them do the like practicals for yourself and like when you've done like some lessons on what like on the stuff and then you get to like do it yourself and then I find when, once I've done it myself I like understand it more yeah because like we did one a couple days ago in um, biology no chemistry and we like had an acid and we like put something in and then we held oh, yeah. our finger over it, the high and then as you let it go, you like lit it, and it went pop. It's a pop test. You, you have like theory lessons where like you do a lot of writing, then you have other lessons where you do a lot of like um, practicals and stuff, and like experiments, which helps me like learn better personally. So because you get to actually be involved with it, so and you get support and like objectives for each lesson, so you, it's easy to look back on and see what you did. freedom you have with like any idea um, there isn't really like a, a limit on what you can do there's always a way you can uh, have, like put any idea in your head into something you can hold and use product design is always really interesting because we can use the big machinery for whatever we're trying to use and we learn how to do it properly and I don't think a lot of people get to do that in their life sometimes so it's super interesting yeah I, I like it really fun because like you do um get they teach you at the start like how to use it what safety if this happens you gotta like turn the machine off straight away but after you've done that it's you're kind of like free-handed they can trust you enough to do it on your own well they're still supervising you but you can do it without them standing right next to you and I just find that having that freedom of doing it just like helps me get on with the work more because it's like I can do it all myself and but I know they're there if I need any like help with doing it so I find that pretty good. In religious studies, uh, the last thing I remember is studying Islam, but we also study lots of other religions, and it helps me to think about how other cultures work and do things differently to us. I enjoy history because I like learning about what made the world how it is today. I find that a lot of humanities teachers, they're quite, um, they're very, what's the word, enthusiastic. They seem quite happy and happy to help with things. Not not different to any other teachers, but like, you know, they seem, um, and they, they know their stuff. They, you can tell that they really enjoy their subject and that they like teaching it. And you can see the reason why they chose to become a teacher for that subject. When I really like film, you can analyse the films and kind of see it from a different point of view so when you can kind of put yourself in the head of the people making the film and see how they're made and it's really interesting to see it from that point of view instead of just watching the film. You get to see it from a point of view where everything's more insightful where you wouldn't have seen it before if you just watched a film 
like you usually would. We actually go in depth. You yeah. get to see things you wouldn't see otherwise. It makes you realise how much effort actually goes into making <laughs> films. It's much harder than you think it is. And yeah. there's, there's so many little details, but when it comes together, it's, it's really, really yeah. cool. And I think in both film and media, it's nice how there's, within the lessons, there's a lot of the group discussions about the film, and it's a lot, it's very nice to kind of hear everyone's opinions on what we've watched and everyone's kind of, I don't know, view on whatever we're doing uh, in both film and media, which is another thing I really enjoy. PE is great and fun because it gets you in a good mood and gets you energetic. My favourite part of PE would most probably be the fact that you can play with your friends, have fun, know that teachers are supporting you, um, even if you're not very good at it, you still are included, and um, yeah, you don't have to worry about not being very good or anything. Yeah, I like it because it's all inclusive, everyone has the right to have a go, take part, and um, so the teachers are helpful, you're, you're learning through playing and they'll do drills, you'll play, it's all good and you can play with your friends at the same time. school um, I didn't really like think about ever doing any like languages but as soon as I did it I found out that it's probably like, the best subject I do and the idea of having like another language is like you, it can open up so many opportunities and stuff yeah I got Mr. Berman as well and um, it's just really fun because it's always games it's never really reading it's always like noughts and crosses where you have to translate the language into English and then back into Spanish and it's really fun um, I think like I've always struggled with like um, tests and stuff like that um, and I thought I would do like really like bad in like languages tests but since having like Miss Berman and stuff I feel really confident so I think it's kind of like a confidence boost really like like Archie said you can like pretty much speak another language and I think it's just boost your confidence having like a subject that you're good at um, and I know it definitely has for me I feel a lot more confident than I did when I came into languages in year seven. Um, and it's, it's also helped with other subjects, I think, to boost your confidence because you think you can do it and it's like massively helped me. Mm -hmm.